Louis G is returning front and center as a public uh, personality. And I can't wait to see him again because he always calls me bro. I like that. Sophie. He's back, Steve. He's <laughs> back and he's looking better than ever. Joining us right now is Louis G from Wild 104 now. Thanks, Louis, for coming out here. Oh, thank you very much for having me. You look wonderful. Thank How'd you. you do it? Well, I, I was pretty much tired of Steve Craig picking on me, so <laughs> I decided uh, to, uh, what I did, I did the uh, gastric bypass. Okay. I went up to Albany, and um, for about a year, year and a half, I prepared for it, and it's a, it's a long process, but I would do it again tomorrow. How do you feel? Yeah. Oh, different I, things day to day, we were talking about it before, what's different now, majorly different? You know what, everything's different. I mean, the energy, nothing hurts. I mean. I mean, it's great to go out and not have to worry about, you know, going in a booth or a table or I can go to the movie. I mean, it's just, it's right. been awesome. Right. I mean, nothing but awesome, you know. The original process, um, the actual surgery was the most painful thing I ever did, but I would do it again tomorrow. Is so. that why you did take some time off, for kind of going on the airwaves? I, you know what, I did because I, I wanted to make sure I did this right. I wanted to take the time to focus on l relearning how to eat. I wanted to, you know, make sure I got to the gym every day and I didn't want any distractions. So I pretty much just dropped off for, you know, a while to, to straighten that stuff out. Right. You know, focus and on yourself. Really yeah, create some good habits, you know. And so, so. Are, you, are you exercising now? Are you um, cleared? Because yes. you were talking about getting cleared by the doctor before. Yeah, I, I actually started walking immediately after the surgery. And now I, I walk every day, but I just got cleared to do some weight training. Uh, they hold off on clearing you to do that only because um, no matter what you do as far as weight training goes, you're using some part of your stomach muscle. muscle. So they just want to be careful of that. But other than that, it's great. It's nice. It's easy to work out. It's fun now. You Can know? you tell us how the number? Can you tell us where you started and now where you're at? How many pounds did you lose? Uh, I'm down 230 pounds wow. since August 20th. Congratulations. Yeah, Louis. thank you. That's thank amazing. you very much. I feel great. We're so. going to come back and ask you about your organization, but we're okay. going to turn things over to Tanya, our good friend Tanya. Hi, Tanya. Hello. Thanks for coming out here. For having us. So what's it like having Louis G? We were talking about it earlier. Everybody's coming up to him at the mall saying hello. He's so popular. What is, what is it like? He's awesome to work with. He's absolutely hilarious. <laughs> it makes getting up at 430 every day worth it. Yeah. <laughs> so the phones have been ringing off the hook all week. Everybody welcoming Louis back to the airwaves. So I'm just happy to have him. And, well, and there's something coming up on Monday's show. Tell everybody now so they can tune in. Battle of the sexes. Oh He's boy. going down. <laughs> Thanks, Tanya. Thank you. So, Louis, oh, there yeah, is. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> there is uh, your organization. Yes. What do you do with that? I have the uh, Louis G Foundation, which I set up uh, a couple years ago. I actually put it on the back burner until after the surgery. Um, because I didn't want any distractions like I mentioned. But now we're just getting back into a full swing of things. Uh, we, did, we're, we were able to help out a bunch of kids when the Harlem Globetrotters were in town, um, which is fun. But I just want to start doing a lot more, and that's gonna, that you're going to see and hear a lot more about that. It's, it's basically to help out underprivileged kids in the Binghamton area. Okay, you know, so. give them a chance to do that they, you know, stuff that they wouldn't normally have a chance to do. So stay tuned. You're yeah. not going anywhere anytime no. soon. You better Ho not. Hopefully. Okay, thanks, Louie. <laughs> thanks, Tanya. When we come back, 